good morning. So the day is here. Our last day in Bangkok. Just giving Eden her last morning walk around the car park. <laughs> And we are just packing up our last few bits, almost done, and then we'll be ready to go. Quite exciting. Come in. Then. We're in the final stages of moving out now. Sasha's just wiping things down. Eden's resting. It's funny though, because normally she's going crazy at this point. She hasn't worked it out yet. The room is looking nice and empty. Just got to pick up a few more items and stuff them in the car. And then we're heading off to Louis. So let's go. You ready to leave, Eden? I haven't got my RTB on yet, so I know I'm not ready. Let me do the honours. We are very calm today. I would just like to say that I've had a very nice time at the Cozy Corner. It's very cozy, but if there was one thing I would change, is that they should put a bigger grass patch in for doggies. Apart from that, it is very cozy, isn't it, Mum? Yes. And I've enjoyed myself. Yes. Yeah. Be back, Maybe. That's a good little review, Eden. Ready to go? Come on then. Come on. Off. You don't want to leave? Come on. Then. Come on. I'm staying. Come on. No, I'm coming. There you go, now you've realised. Yeah, I tricked yeah, you. Realized. I tricked you. <laughs> Bye. Good to go. Well, I'm very excited that I'm coming with you. We would never leave you behind, Eden. Good girl. <laughs> we have decided that our trip to Bangkok will not be complete without one last coffee at La Memoir, our favourite coffee shop in Bangkok. Eden is here with us. She's not having a coffee though. Sasha has just ordered, I believe. I have. What did you get? He knew my order when I went in. He did? That's how you know you've been somewhere too long. Yeah. <laughs> Our journey has come round full circle. The first day we arrived at the Cozy Corner, we came to Le Memoir to have our coffee and a Concord cake. And now our last day, and we're doing exactly the same thing because we can't leave here without having one last Concord, and the coffee here was the best. If anybody's interested in coming to this cafe, I added it to the map. It wasn't on Google Maps, but it's now on the map as Le Memoir Coffee in the Garden. I feel like there was so much more to do here in Bangkok that we never got round to. Even with four months trying to kind of transition between places, it still wasn't enough time to go to the massive JJ Market. There was an abandoned plane I wanted to go and visit. We wanted to go to Bangkok's Lung, which is meant to be like a big green space in between the river and we never got to any of them so there's so much more to see here and if we'd have stayed longer we would have discovered it all but we're not far we could always pop back for little trips Mate can we come see Eden one last time oh, oh my god <laughs> be a good girl <laughs> I've got an RTB on too mum look yeah. I'm going somewhere where are you off to? We've got matching RTBs, Mum. <laughs> oh my God. She does not like me. <laughs> you scared? You need to hide. You scared? <laughs> good girl. Just lie there, be the good one. Concord cake has arrived and I am already <laughs> destroying it. I'm not usually a fan of meringue cakes, 
but this one is really dark and the chocolate is perfect. That's why I like it. Enjoying your last Concord? Yes, you should make it, uh, learn how to make it. Yeah, share cake. For how long? Um, um, for six months. Six months. Yeah, we're really excited to get down there. I love him. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> The Concord cake was delicious, it went down very well and it has just started to pour with rain. So that is our cue to leave the Garden Cafe. Yeah, that's a nice little nest you have. Just went to pay the bill and the owner said it's on me, which is really nice of them. We have really enjoyed drinking coffees at the Memoir and whenever we come back to Bangkok I'm pretty sure we're going to find our way around to this place again because the coffee was really good. Ready? Yeah. We are beginning the long drive to the hotel. We've got about 500 kilometres to drive today to get there. This is it. It is bye bye Bangkok. We are leaving you. to Bangkok Eden. Oh. We've just stopped off at Burger King. Burger King is quite rare out here. I don't see as many of them. We're just eating here on our way up to Luin. Still got a long time to go. It's going to be a long day of driving. For anybody that's interested, these two meals with drinks came to 340 baht in total. So that's like seven, six pound fifty, seven pounds I think. Sasha didn't fancy the bread, so she went for chicken strips instead. Some people will say that you're not really living in Thailand if you're going to fast food places all the time. When you do a lot of driving around like we do, after a while living here, you want the easiest option. You want something that fits into the journey. And we've just pulled into this petrol station to go to the toilet, and the options are KFC, Tesco Lotus, Burger King, and toilet so it's not like we've ignored a load of you know little street food shacks and stuff to come here it was the one place that we just decided to pull off the road and these were the options if you look around all the customers in here are Thai it's not like it's full of Westerners so this is what it's like living in Thailand it's not always what you think it is before you come here sometimes you do pull into a petrol station and just find a Burger King the fries are really good though Burger King is finished. I'm gonna go and get some water from Tesco's over there for the drive. And Eden has fallen asleep on the floor. Hey, did you wake up? You were asleep a minute ago. I was asleep, and now I'm awake. And now I jumped up. Are we going? It's a resume the journey just an observation since we've been here we've been here for at least 45 minutes we have been the only Westerners here and interestingly we have got the oldest car <laughs> quite a few people think that Thailand is a third world nation and just interesting to see what's around us really all right should we continue the drive yeah I'm ready Okay. Just at 
some traffic lights, but I'm gonna go and end the vlog now. We are just gonna be driving for the next four hours and 50 minutes, so not much to report from this car. If you liked today's vlog, please give it a thumbs up and leave us a comment below. And that's it for today, so we will see you tomorrow. Bye.